My friends, welcome back to the United Federation of Planets. Now, last time we had a war declared upon us, we're now into a double war, and our Prime Minister Genesis King died at the wonderful age of 101, uh, which is highly unfortunate. Now, I didn't understand the gravity of this war, actually, uh, since we're no, not only at war with the Zindi, but we're also at war with the Romulan and the Star. So, looking at... Uh, our the attitude is yeah they don't bow well with me. We are at war with all of these. Uh, with, are we at war with the Klingons? God, I hope not. Oh boy, that would have been horrible. Are are we? No, right? Clark, witch, Chukar, the Clark, witch, No, we are not at war with them. Um, so my idea remains: we're going to be taking out the Zindi, and we're going to go for the Serluk. And then we focus all of our efforts on the Romulans. We might lose territory. We'll have a bit of a rough time. Uh, but I'm looking forward to it a lot. <laughs> yes, I do. Uh, we're still trying to get our head with our food. And we'll just see how this will end. So let's continue with our, our tiny little war. There's actually going to be a battle. And we haven't witnessed a battle in a while. Let's see if once again... Uh, let's agree on this. If the the screen is just going to be... Let's all take all of these, actually. It's going to be changing yet again. If it just was a thing from that one episode. Uh, the new Prime Minister is um, Jurek. Or how that is pronounced. I'm hoping that we don't lose any ships. Uh, but chances are extremely likely that we might do so. So, trying to get these guys out would be ideal. Federation membership for one of my smaller colonies. Giving me back 10 as well as an influence. Welcome to Earth. So, yeah, the station falls out actually pretty easily. Uh, hopefully, my allies will focus all of their efforts on fighting the, um, the Romulan Star Empire. Who have a... Well, there are a few fleets. They usually they, they just have smaller fleets, but they're still in a considerable size. Uh, luckily, we have a lot of allies, so that will help. We got Grouch of Gorish and Matt Decker. Matt Decker, isn't he the one from Section 31? The Lauren civilization has entered the war as on both accords. Since they now are part of our empire. Meaning we'll have a planet somewhere. That is in need of a bit of optimization. Uh, like I said we will not be changing anything else. It is quite annoying that we'll have to look like this. We probably are able just to get it. It was here somewhere. It's probably this planet. No sector. Yeah, that, that can never be right. Um, here is the governor. He's actually quite nice. I'll, I'll take him. Anyone else not being in a sector? Mm, where are those guys? We can't change anything about that. Yeah, so we'll just have to start looking for them again. That is annoying. Specialists are arriving, not being able to do anything. I wish there was a different solution to this. Where you could just say, like, on or off all the planets. That would be ideal. I would like that um, a great deal. I don't know which planet just... Did just join. Although he is a fa he is a member, so um, likely is that we don't even see him. Let's get him as well. How many do we have that are just not having a governor right now? Since that would always be a mistake. We're trying to get up to um, over a hundred in our minerals. Actually, all of our edicts are running. And we'll hope that the AI is able to fix this issue because it is rather annoying. And we're going ahead and taking out the Zindi. 
And then we'll be focusing on these fleets. While our other fleet is going in against the Sherlock Cooperative. And we'll most likely lose a good amount of their ships. Actually, let's go ahead and assault this one fleet. With this fleet. Let's make sure we get into the defense. If my allies don't need to care for defense, I think it would be even better. So we, <clears throat> we'll let the attack on to our allies for now. Until they fail. Um, this one's actually... We're winning this fight. So far. Um, not so much in terms of this. We'll lose. Ah, oh, that is annoying. And they will get into my territory. Oh, well, nothing I can do about it right now. I should... But I, I need to focus on one thing before going to another. And taking care of these fleets. And this is a 7k fleet. A 2k fleet. Yeah, we'll have to deal with that. And they are trying to assault this station. And they will proceed. They will do this. Uh, we'll backtrack and take it on. Uh, the Zindi actually got back. Maybe we can actually get a peace deal going with them. Uh, but first things first. We are going to be assaulting this one fleet. If we're able to. They're trying to move out though. And this fleet is most likely heading over towards me. Are we going to deal with the 7k fleet? Who is not high on shield damage. Actually that is quite nice. That's good to know. We'll deal with this one fleet and then go after this one. While trying to take him on. We'll just see what he will do. But we'll have to take all of these two back. Yeah okay so maybe we'll just do it like this. Both of these fleets. Will go after Yeah, those, that station and that station. So it's going to be a considerable sized assault. This station will most likely fall. Actually, yeah, they will. Uh, there's no hope. Uh, he was not fully repaired yet. If he was, they would have won. So here we go. We have a considerable force going in here. Actually, yes, we do. Uh, hopefully we'll actually catch him before he jumps out. No, he was able to uh, get out of this one. Let's attack him. Go. And we'll deal with the 7k fleet. And the Zindi actually took it over. So this fight should go... Uh, definitely towards me. Hopefully we won't lose too many. Since, uh, yeah, that would be quite annoying. Now we still have the station to deal with. We're actually losing a few ships. Now ships that we lose, we are going to be replacing with larger ships. So once the station falls, this should not be a big mess problem. Can I just select this one please? Thank you. And hopefully, let's zoom out a bit. Otherwise, I have deaf audience and we don't want that. Uh, we got the in-trade improvement. The research site, admin cap or going with the federation ideas. Let's go with that since it's cheap. Once we take care of this fleet, they are not going to be as strong. As you can see already, the Vulcans are here dealing with this threat. Uh, so the Zen is almost out. How is the, yeah, the Romulans doing? Will they dare to get in my territory? I, I think they will. And these guys are just, uh, what are you doing? Are, are my ships on like to follow? God, I hope not. I don't need the support. Uh, okay, so 2.8k Zindi fleet is getting in there. Which is nice of them. I'd rather have the, all of them just join right away. Let's take a look at the Zindi ships. So they are also 
against shield damage. Uh, we have to keep that in mind. We want to take, well, get as much shield on our ships as possible then. Considering they do, well, less shield but more armor damage. And for the Zindi or the others, no, the Surluk, also shields and armor. We need a lot of shields on our ships. So we'll change all of the designs. Can we just kill him? He can't get out, right? Uh, we did lose a, a, a lot of ships here. Uh, what do we get? What do I miss? Um, cities have been increased. Okay, cool. Impulse manifold. No, let's go with the Kimsite torpedoes. I'm hoping all of the ships would just get into this uh, region over here. Taking out the Zindi would be ver so nice. They cannot reinforce. This is the only system they'll have. And we'll take all of the war score there. Uh, there we go. Hull breaching phases. Uh, Starbase shield generators. Or an aura for cruisers. Uh, shield hit points negative 20. Mm. All of these are very nice. Um, and this is just for star bases. And that will increase the... Uh, look, we got some good stations. I'm happy that we actually took the effort with our stations. So going with this might even be the best option. Going a tiny bit more on uh, on warring. So where are you guys thinking you're going? Taking on all of that. So the Zindi just had a rough time. And they're going into the negative 11. Uh, even the Surluck is going at a negative. Yeah, because they just lost their fleet. So what we need to be doing is taking this back, healing up. Uh, and looking at our ship design. So, frigates. Uh, armor hit points. Let's get shield gen on that. Why not? Uh, what else? Uh, the, the other one. Again with the armor. Uh, no. We don't want to use the, uh, the armor. Let's go with shields. And upgrade. The Vulcan Cruiser is having shields. So that's quite nice. That's Why that didn't it do this automatically? The Explore also. It just didn't switch to the latest shields. Uh, you. You got a good amount of shields. And I like that. The Walker class. I like the Walker class a lot actually. He has shields. Oh wow, the shield numbers are insane. Uh, our NX flagship, which actually is the weakest ship we have. Can't wait until we actually get um, a new... A new flagship, because this has been way too long. Can we not do like flagship? No. Which is um, annoying, to say the least. So you're over here. Research this project, please. You are doing over here. What are you doing? Uh, nothing. Uh, since you don't have a leader, let's get you on here. And do the assisting in the research. Let's take a look. The war itself. Uh, yeah, I do want to take out... Is this actually in their system? Is this in the... Yes, it is. We can actually heal up. And upgrade somewhere. Can we upgrade? Yeah, we can upgrade. We are going to upgrade. And then we focus on the war effort again. Let's go to our fleets. And we do we need to reinforce? Uh, no. Doesn't appear to be so. Doesn't appear to be so. Good. We are going to upgrade all of our ships and we're going to be taking the fight towards our enemies and oh my. 
a fight it will be. Uh, right now, there is a massive incursion going on in here. And I think... Three... Two, that's five. It's about seven. Nine. Damn. Do we need to counter the Vulcans first? Uh, before we lose all of this terrain. Eventually, they will go towards me. I think we might need to do that. We'll um, we'll keep the Surrex at a lower thing. If I had a third fleet, I would send them towards the Surrex. Uh, since we did lose two ships. And they lost a lot more. Pirates sided in Pajem. We know they can't do anything. Since the pirates are just too weak. Five against a thousand. Yeah, that's not even a fight. It's a slaughter. I don't understand why they would do that. Uh, send it to deep space. Whatever. Please don't die. Shall we upgrade our star base? Uh, because we will mo most likely use it. Quite soon. Uh, we're currently upgrading. Uh, we should have all that we need to do this. So let's on pause. And let's wait for the upgrading to happen. We'll get a lot more shields. We might even go... And get... Who died? No, it's a... Le the Shadow Slayer got a new level. And new technology. Because it was cheap. I quite like to go with the housing... You go with the housing. The rescue mission? Yeah, we can't do that, unfortunately. Yeah, we can do now, but we're in the middle of a war. These guys are getting annihilated. Yeah, we'll have to deal with this. Um, ASAP. Look, my fleets might be the only ones that are capable of doing anything against it. Uh, we did beat the Surlux. So what we will do is, instead of focusing on systems, we will focus on countering fleets. So, by the looks of it, we do have the... Let's see. The Romulans, Garen, the Bolian, the Six. Nah, we will not win this fight. The Borg and the, uh, the Horagian Hunters are declaring war upon each other. Oh no. Oh, that is the one thing that I cannot deal with at the moment. There is a asteroid heading in this direction. Uh, my fleets are out a good amount. Um, let's make go away a new fleet and. Who has the highest pirate suppression? 18? 16? So, this ship, the Explorer, the uh, Miranda class. I can only make one. I would like to make a tiny bit... Actually, just getting the frigates would not be a, a bad thing. We can make four of them. 720. Let us... Um, let's reinforce all. Hopefully they will be made. But I think we're going to be losing a chunk of it. It's unfortunately something we cannot do anything about. Claiming cost. Why not? It's cheap. We have a peace offering from the Huskot and the Klingons. Hopefully they won't declare war. This is a, a really a, a rough situation. Uh, he's upgrading nicely. Going to 9k, that is about the um, the Romulan fleet. And actually, someone is in here attacking us. Um, that might not be your best decision there, buddy. Uh, one just completed. Now, uh, the other one is not drawn in yet. Oh no, there we go. Both are now in.
If we can keep these at bay, the others might focus on the Zindi. Yeah, this is going in my favor really fast now. Yeah, actually, this is going to be a long war, guys. This is going to be a long war. Because we'll have to deal with a, f a war on all fronts. And actually, there we go. We have our very first Romulan fleet in my borders. Now, we could defend our borders. We actually, we, perhaps we should defend our borders. Uh, but first things first. Are my allies heading towards the Sulk? We cannot defend all of them. That's why I wanted to integrate the Soren League first, but apparently I clicked the uh, the Delta Union uh, for some weird reason. There we go. Let's upgrade again. And continue that. Oh! What did I just click? Uh, which is okay. What do we get? A claiming cost. No, this will take like four months. And uh, that's nothing. Let us go. We do have enough alloys, but we're starting to get extremely low here on the food. So let's buy a thousand. Mm. We can't buy anything else though. It's unfortunately, but we can't deal with it at the moment. Yeah, this uh, we try. If if we are able to deal the status quo, I'm hoping they will take it to Delta Union, so they can actually focus on this war. I see this war going bad, and they're just going in with the guarantee of independence. Damn it! I did. I should have checked that. If if this war could have been avoided, it's annoying, but it could have been avoided. Uh, the other fleet is building up. So we're going to be sending you. Stop please. Thank you. Um, did we already lost the planet? Draco, Draken is there. This one. The station is most likely not going to be able to deal with this. Three ships going in, 510. Uh, hopefully he can, but I don't think he will. Uh, physics research or computer? Let's go with the computer. And let's go again. Uh, we need this to upgrade. And we cannot reinforce by the looks of it. So, the Explorer NX class, well, it's useless. This ship is not going to be happening. Let's get you in here. Do we have the multi? Yes, we do. So, let's increase these numbers. NX class still. Oh, we'll just have to deal with it the way it is right now. Upgrading at 28%. Man, that's slow. Let's reinforce. Um, actually, he's done. He is uh, done with the reinforcement or the healing. 35%. Uh, let's do a high intensity yet again. Begin the survey. Time to move on. Okay, the Teller Prime will actually make sure this system does not fall to the uh, to the Romulans. Oh uh, yeah, but we're we're like split in the center. This needs to end now. We're status quo on 15. They will accept. Can we urge them to accept the status quo? And negative 29. Uh, cheap tech, cheap cheap tech. Let's go with that. The assimilation. I think this will. This does this have anything to do with the Borg? We'll see. Okay, so a small fight is going on. 
which just stops my progress again. Come on, upgrade. Well, ships that are upgraded are upgraded, right? And we don't have to worry about those. Uh, what is the minerals to count? This is not doing anything. You still have unemployment. You don't have enough houses. Let's build this and let's continue on with mining network. Perhaps he was saving for something. If he was, we'll never know. Specialist. Well, getting more alloys would be nice, but getting more supplies would not be a bad idea either. Uh, but we'll uh, let the rest handle by the AI. Are you almost... Are we going to make it? Well, I think maybe the station itself could deal with an asteroid. Interesting. Okay, let us get ourselves another Admiral. Let's get Matt Decker. I'm not sure if he is the Section 31 guy, but if he is, then sure, why not? So the Serlik should be going ahead in War Exhaust. Yeah, 44%. That's, that's what's been handling. Uh, even the Romulans are not doing as well as they hoped, I guess. 43 12% Kind of would have hoped that you would be the first one to be upgraded though So this one's out So why are you still here? What are you doing in here? Now we need to start dealing with the Romulans We do Getting this 9k fleet in here would be nice Still, I'm hoping to go with the uh, upgrade, though. The additional shield size would be nice. Considering the uh, Romulans, they do have some shield weapons. But they're not using too many of them. Just a few. So, we would actually be doing okay-ish against them. There is a Romulan fleet as well. Yeah, those fleets are the most annoying one. They are above here. So he's fighting the uh, so-called alien vessel. We actually got our station back. There's a 3k going in right now. And apparently the Tarai sector did lose all of their ships. Yeah, we'll have to start pushing out towards the Romulans. Considering they are the strongest right now. I will foresee that they will start pushing into the Serlic terrain. Fighting a war on two ends never is a good thing. Not like this. I should have looked better. I always neglect that. Fleet is at full strength. So somewhere fleets are trying to get through all of this. There's a 6k fleet in here again. Hmm, not happy about it. Oh well, what can you do? Uh, let's get Network Bunkers. Since that is probably like one or two months. There you go. Naval Cap plus 40. Sounds a lot more excited than it is, mm, but we'll take it, since we are most likely going to be in war for a long-ass time. Okay, so 56, 57. We'll have to send both of these in over here and then start dealing with the Romulans. Uh, we'll not deal with the pirates, hopefully the Romulans would send in a fleet by themselves, that would be the best. The Bolan fleet here should be able to deal with that. He can't deal with this though. But there... Yeah, that's too much. Sherlock's trying to take this. Yeah, we need to take this all back. Are you done? No. Damn it! And these multi-vector ships, they take forever. 
I should stop. Damn my timer. Look at all of these fleets going in. Sorry, guys, that this is a longer episode than usual. I hope you're enjoying yourself. I, I'm enjoying it because I'm losing track of time already. Um, this, this, this war is going to be rough. This one, not so much. Uh, but we'll see how things will be going. As for now, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hope to see you next time. And leave a like. Perhaps. See you next time. Goodbye.